Blessings my viewers, welcome back to the channel. Watch, like, share, comment and subscribe. Hit the bell if you are also new to the channel and my viewers. Remember like in the video automatically recommends YouTube's algorithm to show our video more. Yeah man, so the more you like, the more you watch, the more YouTube recommend the video. 8 million stolen, vandalized ATM found after the robbery. An ATM which is believed to have contained more than 8 million was discovered, destroyed and the compound of a Darlingston great house in Westmoreland and Thursday several hours after a group of heavily armed men stole it from a service station in the community. The management at Jeminson service station in Darlingston, Westmoreland are fearing that their establishment has now become a feeding tree for criminals after being the target of yet another robbery. Just nine months ago, there was a major robbery at this same location where armed robbers entered the gas station, held us at gunpoint and robbed us, and now another incident where a group of men break into the place and took away the ATM machine. A manager told the news. The manager said that on this occasion, the crooks were able to spend more than half an hour robbing the establishment we are all now living and working in fear it is very hard for us to come to work each day because you don't know when someone is going to pounce upon you he added we crying out for help here we need some help early thursday morning about 12 heavily armed men broke into the service station and stole the atm which is believed to have contained over 1 million along with other items surveillance footage capture the crooks driven in into the service station compound about 2 30 am they then use heavy machinery and power tools to cut the grill at the entrance of the service station and the minimart before entering the establishment and cut away the large atm which was bolted to the floor the bandits then proceed to rob the minimart of cash, liquor, phones, accessories and cigarettes before driving away. Thursday morning robbery came weeks after a similar hit at a ILO food store outlet in Fairview, Montego Bay. In that breaking, thieves made off with an estimate of 2.5 million in cash taken from a cambio along with dozens of IN smartphones as well as millions in cash and other items for a supermarket. One police source told the news that the similar to the incident in Montego Bay, the thieves in Darlington used heavy power tools, crowbars, sledgehammers and steel cutters to gain access to the premises and carry out the robbery. Yeah man, my viewers are right now as you can see. The thieves them getting smarter. They go off a eye. Eye, eye, my viewers. I valued target. Man, them now go off on a little robbery thing, hold you up and take away your phone and them thing that again, my viewers. A crazy thing I go on out there in another area. US 1.4 million worth of ganja seized in Portmore. The Narthotics Police Division and Thursday seized over 100 and over 1,100 pounds of compressed ganja doing an operation in Portmore St. Catching. The police say about 8.30 p.m. lawmen were in the area when they signaled the driver of an under step wagon motor car to stop. The driver of the vehicle reportedly disobeyed the instruction of the police and sped away. The police team then pursued the driver who later abandoned the vehicle and ran into bushes. A man escaping nearby bushes, that's how they do it. A search of the vehicle was conducted and over 1,100 pounds of compressed ganja was allegedly found. The police say the elite drug has an estimate street value of over US $1.4 million. Some of you as watch, like, share, comment and subscribe. Hit the bell if you are new to the channel. If you are not yet subscribed to the channel, please do so by hitting the subscription button. Turn on the bell icon, click all so you'll be notified whenever I release fresh news and reviews on each and every day. Blessings of viewers, JNN.